we're gonna check out a Catholic church here in Abuja. Um, I actually went to Catholic school growing up, so it'll be a little interesting for me, you know, getting to see how things are a little bit different here, maybe. Maybe they're the exact same. I don't know. Let's find out. Akuna Matata. <laughs> okay. Is there a specific area within Nigeria that has like a larger concentration of Catholics than most other places? Um, the concentration of Catholics is the eastern part of Nigeria. The east, so like the southeast? Yeah, yeah, yeah the southeast part of Nigeria. A better uh, number of Catholics, actually. If you go to a Catholic church in maybe Kano, is it very likely the priest will be from the southeast? Yes. Yes, it's most likely the priest will be from the southeast, but we still have a few from like Kanu who are also in the priesthood and mm -hmm. pastor the seminary training, you know, but if you don't talk about those who have actually uh, maybe gone for mission about the majority of them are from southeast. Do you think there will ever be but like within our lifetime, like within the next 30, 40 years, do you think there will ever be possibly a pope who comes from Nigeria? I think it's possible. Um, I think the uh, parties of our faith with God, everything is possible. So um, just for us to give it time, and then God himself will decide. Is there very many high ranking, um, like, yes, we have, we have many high ranking, like. Currently, we have uh, an active cardinal, Cardinal John Nikon, is still an active cardinal. Um, if the uh, conclave today will attend, okay, so, wow. like Nigeria is the only active cardinal, and okay, is eligible for because the conclave is at today. This is seven hundred naira. Okay, can I have this one? Okay. Is this where you go? Yeah. Is this is this the church? No, I didn't worship here. My parish is Holy Family. Oh, okay. Holy Family. Yeah. Amen. Reverend Sister Ebere Chuku Uboke, Holy Family Sisters of the Living, walking in there. Our Lady Queen of Nigeria bookshop. This is the bookshop. Where we say sacramentals. If you are Catholic, you understand what it means. Okay. Where are you from? I'm from Enugu State. Enugu State? In so you're from the Southeast also? Yes. Okay. In the Southeast, I've heard that they have um, many people who still practice uh, traditional religion. Is that true? Um, do you think there is very much overlap? Like, is there very many people who are Catholic who also practice traditional uh, religions or faiths? Yes, but uh, normally what I know, you know, them being a Catholic, doing all that traditional thing is a kind of something secret. Something say secret? Secret, yeah. Okay, so they keep it to themselves yeah. when they do that. but on Sunday you see them in the church. So. So, there, I haven't seen this, because I haven't been to the southeast yet, I haven't seen this there, but when we were in Yoruba land, in the west, we saw there was an idol for the devil, that people were putting palm oil and gin as a sacrifice to the devil. Is that something that any Catholics do in Nigeria, or is that something that's for the west? It's all over. Every okay. state, I think they have such. They have that? For those who believe in it. Do, do you think there's very many Catholics that do that? Like, what's the official Catholic church stance? Catholic can't. They can't do that? Uh, unless if they want to do it privately, maybe a private affair. But those who believe in Catholic, they believe in God and God alone. How long have you been working here? Five years now. How long have you been a sister? How long have you been a nun? Seven Seven years? Compared uh, with my formation uh, training, it's 
11 years now. What did you do for work before you became a nun? I just finished my secondary school. Then after that, I worked for somebody in the technology office selling phone okay. in order to help myself. Okay. So from there, I entered school, Institute of Management and Technology, in the IMT. So from there, I felt that God is calling me and I have to move and enter religious life. And I'm happy since then. Okay. In the life. You want to lead this one? Mm -hmm. this, is, I will talk, you you okay. this is our lady, Queen of Nanjia Pro Cathedral, Abuja. You are welcome. Take the salad to her. Do they not have holy water at the door? No, they didn't. Yeah. Usually, in Catholic Church, they have holy water at the door. Yes, 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 they, they, they do, they do, they do. You can still take it off. Oh, wow, that's really nice. Do you know all these things? No, I don't know. They're not even all what? No, no, they're not all saints. So see, it's got David and Goliath, Holy yeah, Family, yeah. the Ascension. So obviously, with a lot of our videos being in Mexico, we go to a lot of Catholic churches. This is our first Catholic church here in Nigeria. It's a very different architectural style, which is interesting. Um, but it's still a very, very beautiful building. It's even got three floors worth of, uh, of pews that people can come worship and practice in. And yeah, it's really nice to see this. It's definitely a totally different look than they have in Mexico, but it's still just as beautiful, I'd say. And this is where the bishop would sit. It's called the cathedral. Right. The cathedral. Do a Hail Mary for us. You don't know it? No, I don't. You don't? I you do. Don't? I, I do what I can. Hail Mary. For the, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among the men. And blessed the fruit of the Lord Jesus. Holy, Holy Mary, Mother of God. Pray for us now. Now I do for our days. Amen. There we go. Now do an Our Father. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Thou will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us, and lead us not into temptation. Amen. All right, I hope you enjoyed our brief look at the Catholic Church here in Nigeria. Got to ask a few questions, talk to a few interesting people. I'm sure plenty of you guys out there are Catholic who are watching this, especially since uh, most of our audience is in the Philippines. So, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Do, do, do. Amen.